So in this video, I want to talk with you about the success journal. It's something that we do on a regular basis um, and we have our clients do and everybody that does it, it really has a powerful impact on their life. It's such a simple process, but it has such a huge impact. I mean, it's kind of ridiculous when because it literally reframes your brain to see success in the world. And when you see success by law of attraction, law of focus, whatever you want to call it, law of vibration, you create more success in your life. So I'm going to go through this simple principle right now. Every day when I go out, I go out to some place like this here at the mall and I do my practices or whatever's going on. I'm texting a cute girl. I'm flirting wherever I feel changes in growth. At some point in the day, I write it down. It's simple as that. If I'm walking out here and I'm looking at people and they're all around and I'm saying, do my highs, let's say. Let's say I did 100 highs today and, I, and I'm out here going, hey, how you doing? How you doing? And I'm feeling open and I'm feeling good. I'll write down what I learned from that. Oh, that really cute blonde really smiled back and my heart blasted wide open. Um, that one guy said, dude, you're a really cool dude. You know, it's, I'm glad I met you after we chatted for a bit. Um, uh, I got that girl's phone number. Or how about this? This is even better. These are the great examples. You're sitting there and you're, you get rejected, right? But then it doesn't bother you for the first time. And you're like, wow, that didn't bother me. And you write that down. A girl laughs at you and walks away. And you laugh at yourself and walk away. And then another girl smiles at you because of it. That's a huge gain, right? You go out and ask for rejections. Maybe you do that exercise. You ask for rejections and you realize after four or five rejections, you're laughing at yourself. First it was horrible and now you're laughing. It's easy and you're like, oh, it's no big deal getting a rejection. I love it. And then you start to laugh at yourself and you write that down. And if you write down gains every day, maybe five, ten gains, three gains, just a few gains, and you read them right before you go to bed, so you take them into your dreams, you start to grow. You start to change. You start to see the world from the perspective of your growth, how you're changing, and not the perspective of your pains and what you need to fix. A lot of our clients come to us and they, they're in a lot of pain and all they think about is what's wrong, what's wrong, what's wrong, and all they focus on is what's wrong. And so they're actually doing a pain journal in their mind. They're doing a, a failure journal like, oh, that girl looked at me funny. And they will go out and five girls will smile and wave. One girl looks at them funny. That's all the client can think about all day long. That's, that's not right. But if you switch that and suddenly you start to see in your mind, I'm talking about internally, you switch it internally, and you start to see those successes and you quickly forget about the failures, how much faster is your life going to compound? Compounding interest is the eighth wonder of the world. It's gonna be huge, it's gonna grow a lot. And that's what I want this journal to do for you. So I'm gonna ask you to do me a favor. First, look up compounding interest online. Look up a, a one to 31 days of, of doubling a penny and notice that at the end of 31 days, that will be over $10 million if you double a penny for 31 days. And most of the growth in the last few days. And if you can do that, that process, and you can see that growth, I'm gonna challenge you to do a success journal for 31 days, just like the compounding interest chart. Do it for 31 days and notice at the end of that 31 days how much your life has changed. Now there's a couple rules. You have to write at least I would say five things in there a day. Three minimum, five preferably, and if you feel like doing 10 one day, write down 10. Read them before you go to bed. Right as you're going to sleep, just read them right before you lay your head on that pillow so you take them into your dreams and you start to dream about these successes. And if there's any resistance in the first week, that's fine, that's normal. Just keep working through that a little bit at a time. And notice, if you commit to the 31 days and you follow it through to the end, how much it's gonna change the way you view the world in relationship to women or whatever area you're using it on. Really, and it's good if you pick an area, unless you just wanna work on general all life skills. It's gonna have a powerful effect. And remember, only the confident really live. Get started on that success journal now because that's gonna make you more confident. Only the confident really live. I'll see you in the next video, take care.